welcome back to Dog Sled Saga! It is indeed that time of the year again. With December 1st here and winter upon us, it is time to return to the snowy lands where we have our snow dog team! Look at them! Oh my gosh, I can't believe it's almost been a whole year since we have seen everybody! And do we have a puppy on the way? Do we actually have a puppy on the way? I totally forgot that we bred some of our dogs last time and we do indeed have a puppy on the way. That is so exciting. But welcome back to season two, year two of Dog Sled Saga, my friends. And we have actually gone on quite a few amazing adventures with our sled dog team. I highly recommend going and checking the very first playlist out so that you too can understand why it is so exciting to have Everpine and Sierra with us and Harmony and Domino and Yuki and Maximus. Oh, I'm so happy to see all of them. It has been so long since we have rolled around with all of our puppies. We have gone on races with them and we have really tried our hand at becoming better mushers. How much money do I have? Uh, I think we have, we don't have very much money and we have very huge bills. What is this? <laughs> We have um, a $17,000 bill coming up in the future because we have six registered dogs and a very good employee. So that's, that's pretty hefty. That's pretty darn hefty, you guys. And we're going to have to pay for that. And we're going to have to go on races to earn the money so that we can take care of our sled dog team, continue to expand our wonderful sled dog cabin, and even continue to add to the family by breeding our dogs together and being able to get some of their puppies, as well as going and being able to hire and adopt dogs. Let me see if I can remember how on earth to get there, by the way. <laughs> It has been so long. I'm like, wait, what? wait, no. It has been so long I threw us back to the main screen. Uh, if we wanted to hire another dog, we can actually come over to the roster. It would cost us even more money. I'm not sure we have. And then we would be able to find all sorts of sled dogs to add into our team who have different skills, different personalities, who might get along with different dogs better than others. We can even oh, show rehires. <gasps> we can even rehire some of the dogs that we have bred and we have released off into the world we could rehire some of the dogs who just didn't work out for our team and try training them anew that is so much fun so these would be the new dogs that we could possibly add to our team gromit oh my gosh where's the professor is the professor somewhere where is our professor okay it doesn't look like the professor is with us right now i don't think we're breeding him but the professor was a little small dog who was quite hilarious when it came to racing but there's a lot that we can do and if this seems really confusing to you again i highly recommend going back and watching at least a few of the episodes from the first season because we talk about how all of the mechanics work we really celebrate all of the fame go max go we have some of the most adorable fan art from last Last season to show off with you guys and I can't wait to see where our stories take us this time. I know having Dog Sled Saga up and going again for winter is something so many of you have been looking forward to, to for quite a while. Is it really day 519? Oh my gosh. But all right, so where are we? Let me triple check on everything. Okay, can't really look over those notes right now. Uh, we are in League 6, and if we want to go and apply for a higher league, we would go to the League office, and I think the only league that's higher is League 7, and League 7 would kind of be, in quotations, winning the game. Um, and I think, let's see, expand the kennel, but we can continue to expand the kennel, so we might try to work on expanding the kennel and just becoming super, super rich. Uh, we're currently breeding our dogs so I think that we're about to get a puppy or we bred our dogs it's been so long that I cannot remember what we're doing who do we have as staff oh that's right we hired the jerk who used to be our like person we raced against our rival we actually finally beat him enough times in racing that he decided he wanted to learn from us and he gives a huge training and caretaking perk to taking care of all of the dogs in the kennel 
So that is pretty hilarious. We have some really great sponsorships with food bags, funding, and rope going on right now. Uh, and I guess what we're going to do is we're going to try to earn enough money to get into League 7 and go into League 7 races. And we're going to try to expand our kennel as big as it can possibly go and become super rich so that we can have all of the dogs we possibly could want. And yes, I did slip a pun in there. <laughs> all right, so let's see. We have Maximus, Yuki, Everpine's a little bit fatigued so we might have her rest today sierra harmony and domino uh, i can't remember which each of their individual skills are but you can see all of these stats for each and every one of our puppies including their special skill type if we have discovered it their recent like their favorites if uh let's see yeah, her fault is that she's really bad at catching when we throw the treats to her while we race her favorite thing is to win a victory and her specialty is being at the wheel uh and she's level three specialty at the wheel which is fantastic even though she's a natural yeah she's a natural at the wheel too it's kind of funny because they like put wheel middle and lead but then they flip it here so that could confuse you and she has really good rapport with Sierra and Domino so and fame level 8 no less she's been on the team for over 286 days I love it I love it I love it I love that we can learn so much about our dogs but let's go ahead and move on to the next day um can we enter the race is there a current race. I'm pretty sure there's a current race and I actually wanted to join it. Regime. Uh, can we go? Yeah, let's enter the race. Okay, so we're going to go ahead and enter the race and let's see. Can Yuki come with us? Okay, so Yuki is really good at being a wheel dog. Maximus, I guess we need to go. Oh no, can I not get out of this? I don't remember which dog is good at what. What if I pick the wrong dog? Sierra, why don't you come with us? Uh, do I need five dogs for this race? Oh my gosh. All right, Maximus. Um, and then we'll go ahead and take Harmony. I feel like I'm definitely missing some puppies. Oh, thank goodness. Okay, I could back out for just a second. Oh no, I can't. Okay, well, we're committed, guys. We're committed. I don't remember exactly what's happening. I don't remember who should really be in what position. Apparently Domino is in danger of being here because he's super exhausted. Uh, his position is lead specialty level six. So if I move him there, Maximus, or level three, excuse me, Maximus, it, his specialty is the lead. Thankfully, Sierra and Harmony have specialty of being in the middle. Um, and then, ooh, 200% chance of his positive trait happening for Maximus today. Hmm. And then his favorite thing is to get fame. So if he can catch some of the treats, that will give him a lot of fame. I'm going to move Maximus a little closer to us because he's still new at the races. And I might be able to feed him faster that way. And we're just going to have to kind of cross our fingers and hope that I... No, Maximus! I don't want him to feel dangerously. Okay, I really have to keep him close to me so I can take good care of Maximus. All right. All right. Good. Domino has been in 83 races. Let's do this. We're leaving Embarkment Lake and we're going to somewhere. Hmm. All right. It's been so long since we've done this, guys. Oh my gosh. And we already have exhausted puppers. Gosh, it's been so long since I've done this. I hope I can. I can. Oh, there you go, Maximus. I really hope I can get this right. Toss up to Domino. Okay, thank goodness we got new treats. Okay, gotta get our dogs stretched out. They're starting to tangle the lines a little bit. Maximus is a little tired. I just bonked Yuki on the head like a second before she was supposed to get the treat. Domino is feeling hungry. Maximus is feeling hungry. We're back in the thick of things. Oh, if only I could have been in an easier race to start us off. Oh my gosh. Maximus basically just needs to be like straight up fed all of the treats we can possibly get for him. All right, go Maximus. Yay, and he got fame, which is his favorite thing. All right. I actually haven't seen any. Oh, just as I was saying, oh my gosh. Did you guys see all of that? Our puppers are getting a lot of fame now. Oh, and look at Maximus. He's so happy. Maybe he's just a better dog to have in the middle, even if like his natural talent tends to be at the lead. <laughs> he seems to be doing really well in the middle. Oh no, my treats. Okay, quick jump. Maximus, eat this. No, Maximus, if you'd caught it after eating, or if you'd eaten it after jumping over a boulder, you would have gotten fame. Okay, hang in there, guys. Oh, gosh, I'm so sorry. I'm pushing my puppy so hard. It's just tricky because it's been so long since I've gone on these races. Come on, Yuki. Whoa, there's so much fame happening. It's very distracting to have the paparazzi just, like, flashing their camera in front of your face. Are we in first? Go, guys, go. I 
I'm so proud of all of you! Good job! All right, not bad for being fresh off of a long summer vacation from racing our dogs in Dog Sled Saga, eh? Eh? Well, that was awesome! All right, and Yuki is actually maxed out as far as it goes on talent, but she had her favorite thing and quite a bit of fame under her paws. Increased her rapport with Harmony. <gasps> Maximus! And then his fatigue capacity is maxed out. He's pretty darn exhausted, so I need to take good care of him, but he got his favorite thing, which is fame, and it had been a long time since he had had his favorite thing, so that should make him happier. Harmony had her favorite thing as well. I'm not sure what it was, maybe it was Victory, and her rapport went up with both Maximus and Yuki. Meanwhile, Sierra is a little bit tired from that race. Oh, Sierra, it's so good to see you again, girl. And she's got quite a bit of fame. It seems like everybody got a little pinch of fame from that. And Domino, geez, he's just like a professional at this. That was fantastic. So that was wonderful, you guys. Apparently we can replay an animation. Oh, that's so cool. So you can like replay all of what your dogs did if you really want to just see them be super happy. Uh, and let's see, four, 84 races is the lead. Yeah, that's why I think he only got one fame because everybody's like, oh, that's Domino. And even if he's good at what he does, they're, they're all over it. And then we had Sierra's perfect catch made her happy. Harmony's fame made her happy. Uh, and then we've got fame. Oh, and Maximus now has middle specialty level one. You know what? I think I'm going to keep him in the middle. He had specialty for the lead, but I think I need to keep that big old Maximus a little bit closer to me so he can eat all the treats he wants. <gasps> Striker and Max are back. I knew we had Max somewhere around here. And we have a new little baby girl puppy. She looks like she is actually, um, oh my gosh, what should we name her here? I'm going to roll a dice and we'll name her within four names. Is she Rocky? I don't think so. What about Sadie? Maybe, uh, not that one. Or Mary, oh, let's name her Mary. That's a perfect name because it is actually December. We're celebrating returning to Dog Sled Saga with the arrival of winter. Mary it is. Welcome back, so Maximus. Oh, congratulations, Stryker. Congratulations, Max. I am so excited to see you two again. Stryker, your daughter looks just like you. I'm so excited to see you. So she is back. She is a good middle runner for sure. She's natural at the middle and she has run 62 races at the middle. She also has fame level eight. She has a very high rapport with Sierra, Domino, and Max. Uh, and she's been on the team almost the entire time that we have been running the races. So Stryker now has a daughter named Mary and she and Max had that puppy together. And yeah, he's got pretty good rapport with a lot of the dogs. He also has wheel specialty, which is really good because that will actually allow uh, Yuki to get a little bit of rest when she needs it. She's a natural at the wheel, but it's important to have dogs that are talented uh, at the wheel and the middle and the lead uh, more than one of them because then you can rotate out your team so they don't get too fatigued but that's so exciting so in seven more days we will actually be ending up with a new puppy that we can see what her skills are we can see if she's good at the races we can train her and we did pull in quite a bit of money uh, we only have 26 more days to somehow make enough money to cover that gigantic bill but we're gonna do our best and and in eight days is when the Fireball Kennel to Monument to Aurora race, which is short, is actually going to be. It's a short five dog race. So, hmm, okay, well, let's go ahead. We're going to set everybody up on a regime so that they can rest. Uh, we're gonna have, let's see, who needs rest? Maximus needs a lot of rest. Harmony needs a lot of rest. Sierra needs a lot of care. Domino needs a lot of care. And then Striker, Max, and Yuki just straight up need like rest, rest. Uh, unfortunately, I don't think we can like give them as much care as they need. Um, and we're, oh, here, I can care for them. Oh, thank goodness, okay. So there we go. All of the dogs are being cared for. Yes, the jerk is actually a really good caretaker of our puppies. That makes me happy. And then as we give our dogs more ability to rest, they will actually have their fatigue go down, but you have to watch out because a dog that doesn't race very much is actually a dog that you might end up having their skill drop on. So now that we got this set up, let's see, and do we need 
Yuki, see Yuki and Striker and Max are all ready to go. So now we would actually swap out to training dogs. Yuki, Striker, and Max ready to go. And we're gonna leave the other dogs who still need a bit of rest with the jerk. I like how his name is still the jerk. And then the dogs who are training with me will have their skill increase instead of lose out on a little bit of their skill because they're just lounging around in front of the fireplace, warming their paws. All right, and we can pull Domino into training as well. Uh, whoops, nope, I wanna train my puppers. And then Domino, where are you? And we'll pull him on in. There we go. And we don't have any idle puppies, thank goodness. And speaking of puppies, let's actually invite in little Mary, a brand new puppy to celebrate the beginning of everything that we are doing this year. I can't believe it's been a whole year since we have actually gone through <laughs> And we have done everything uh, and the caretaker we're gonna just have the jerk take care of a couple of our puppies Even though Maximus is the only one who's still tired. Oh the race is today. What the heck? Okay Well, there's a surprise race today. I can't turn down a pop-up race for the first place is six thousand six hundred dollars Because I am pretty poor right now. So we're gonna go ahead. We're gonna pull in our puppies Maximus is swapped out if I remember correctly um, Gosh, yeah, okay struggle Max is a wheel specialty, so I'm gonna actually pull Max out. I I need to swap him out. Uh, let's see, regime, racing with me, uh, enter the race. There we go. So we're gonna switch Max out and let Yuki go ahead. Well, Max can come in, we'll let Yuki rest because Max is a wheel specialty. Domino is our lead specialty. Everpine doesn't have a assignment just yet and Maximus is still resting. Harmony is actually a good middle dog though. Let's just go ahead and grab Harmony and then we're going to have him take care. Come here, come here of Yuki. Maximus needs to rest one more day. All right, let's do this. And let's put Domino straight up in the lead. Max at the back. Everybody else is lined up where they belong. Harmony, Striker, Sierra, all of these dogs are very skilled, very talented. They have been on dozens of races together. And we are going to tackle this and bring home the bacon so that we can take care of the new puppy who's going to be joining our rank soon. There you go, guys. Come on. We've got this. We've got this. Wee! Somebody got some fame up there. Oh no! Oh my gosh, how did he catch that? Did you see that unbelievable catch? Gotta watch out for these obstacles, there's so many. Oh my gosh, but yeah, you usually get fame if you can have them. Oh, did you see that? The tree had the, the tree bounce off of it. And we still managed, come on Sierra! Sierra, come on! Oh no! Oh no, oh no, oh no! <laughs> There's so much trouble happening right now. Sierra, here. Okay, there you go, Striker. No! Striker, your tree. Oh no, Domino, hang on. This is proving to be very difficult. I don't remember trees being so hard to deal with. And there's a lot more obstacles than I anticipated. <laughs> All right, hang in there, guys. My fumble fingers might activate. Oh, thank goodness, I threw that tree right over the tree and the puppy actually got it. Come on guys, there's so much money at stake here. But my fumble fingers needs to stay away. That's what we call it when I mess up. It's a little bit harder than it looks, especially when I haven't done this in a year. Uh, to get all the puppies lined up, to get them tossed about, to get them eating their treats on time. There's so many obstacles on this race. What is this nonsense? There's so much fame just showering down around us, but that's actually causing more problems because I can't see. Paparazzi, why? Just let my puppies help us win. Oh, we were so close. That was neck and neck at the last moment. Well, good job, puppers. We still managed to get $3,300, which is definitely going to help us out. But here we are, guys. I am so excited. There is something so thrilling. Oh my gosh, Max. I forgot how everybody loves Max. <laughs> Max is just like a fame hog. It always cracks me up. He always gets so much fame. But we've got the fame going through the roof on that race. I guess they were just really photogenic and everybody loved them. Look at that. Harmony has leveled up on her fame. What do we have here? Oh no, I didn't mean to skip a whole puppers. That's not what I wanted. My gosh, I mean, look at all of this. We're just showered with fame. There were, there were pictures being taken all over the place. There we go, nice, all right. And then we had, oh, only one fame for Sierra, so. 
<laughs> Max, how did you get 20 fame? Oh, and Harmony 21. Max and Harmony, maybe we should have them have a puppy. My gosh. But all right, guys, I totally missed out that there's two race icons down here. I feel a little bit silly now. And we have a little bit more money. So you know what? With 21 days left and two days before the puppy arrives, I think we're actually doing pretty darn good. So we will continue to add in more puppers. We will continue to expand the kennel and we'll continue to try to save up so that we can try to apply and win the seventh league competition. Ah, oh, that's quite a bit to do, but we'll enjoy the next couple of months of having Sled Dog Saga slip on in. I hope you guys will enjoy it too. Cheer on your favorites. Make sure you're nice to each other in the comments, and I will see you all next time. Bye-bye.